Very good morning here from Germany. <laughs> we are having a breaking news. Uh, yesterday evening, actually, out of nowhere, suddenly Virgin Galactic decided to announce that they are changing the CEO position. And this is something that first I thought it's something maybe unplanned. Maybe George Whitesides wanted to change, you know, his lifestyle or whatsoever. But then once we also hopped on, on the conference call, which which uh, followed afterwards, and also with my members and everything, we will talk about everything that uh, concerns this new change and the stock increase by today. Um, but then it made much more sense once you hear what Shamas and other people on uh, the leadership of Virgin Galactic said to this change. And it's absolutely brilliant move, guys. And I believe uh, that this is will very, very positive for the further outcome of the stock. So let's dive into the agenda for today's vlogs. Um, I thought I will do this this morning directly so you will be informed what's going on with Virgin Galactic and also this all before the market I know it's for some of you guys it's middle of the night uh, maybe some of you are, are watching right but I guess uh, most of you guys are from uh, Europe or Asia so uh, let me know in the comments below as always uh, where you are watching from. So first, I will welcome, of course, as always, uh, all the new members that joined since yesterday. Then we will talk about the new CEO role. Then we will talk about the conference call that I and uh, my members participated yesterday. And we will talk about the compensation, which is also quite interesting. Um, so those are the topics for today's stream. And uh, I see uh, some people here from Qatar. We see Indonesia, Scotland, New Zealand, Greece, our brand new uh, member Burak from Istanbul. We have Austria, London. So fantastic. Thank you very much, guys. And uh, let's dive directly into the welcoming of the brand new members. So we have Original Diamonds by Jason who joined the wolf pack here. We have Burak, who is a real wolf. So he gets also the access to the Discord chat, guys. And uh, TO33X uh, is the ultimate wolf, which also gives him one-to-one -one with me. And if you are still work wondering what all of this is, check out the most uh, best membership opportunity here on YouTube, guys. Uh, there's three tiers. You can support the channel. You can get access to the Discord channel, which we will talk about a little bit later because it was quite fun yesterday. And also you can get one-on-one -on -one with me. Just uh, we will connect over social media, talk about stocks, talk about your ideas you, about the market, everything what you want to know to make you a better investor. I believe there's no other big value out there that any YouTuber in the financial world are offering. So stay tuned. Uh, check out the join button below all my videos and live streams. I would be looking forward to see you on the other side and discuss with you. And then dive diving in directly into the main topic. So Virgin Galactic changing its CEO. What does it mean? So Michael Cole Glazer is a veteran in terms of experiences, guys. Okay, he's managing for 30 years all the theme parks in the whole world for Disney. So Shanghai, LA, um, oh sorry, Shanghai, uh, California, uh, Florida, um, uh, uh, Paris. Okay, so he is 
the guy behind your experience at Disney's theme parks, okay? And they brought him into the role replacing George Whitesides, who will become the chief space officer. All right, so he stay in the company, just get another role, and Michael Colglazer will manage and lead the commercial ops for the space tourism part. And first of all, you think, well, George Whitesides did quite a well job, right? So he, uh, since he's 10 years already with Virgin Galactic, brought the team from 30 employees to 900 employees. Um, um, uh, lead the company uh, operation-wise through the public um, offering of the company. Um, he uh, uh, is very close or, or brought very close all engineers and all operational people together to bring almost the, the final product to market, um, uh, which is unprecedented, obviously, because nobody did it before in this kind of way. Um, and then you see that he's stepping down. So I thought first, well, what, what is the real reason? But once you understand the strategy behind it, it's very intelligent because now they are very close. And Shama said it in the conference call months, not just, just months, not years or whatsoever away from commercial operations. So we guess that this year, will be definitely the first tourist into space or uh, suborbital space, all right? Um, and this is uh, important to understand. And this is like a whole core business. Uh, while the management say that this might just be 10, 15% of the overall revenue one day, right? So they need somebody that create an experience out of that, that every, you know, possible potential client want to do this experience, okay? So that's why they bring this guy from Disney just to bring his secret sauce, what they did at the theme parks to make also for Virgin Galactic. And George Whiteside is actually having the much more important job right now. So he's becoming the chief space officer and will concentrate with a team only on point-to-point -point hypersonic travel, on orbital uh, uh, space uh, uh, flights and so on. So, so basically he finished a product, give it to one guy to really make the best out of it, to milk the cow, and then George Whiteside going directly to the next step of the company. So while George is you know, concentrating on the next big thing, Michael will create the best experience that it is there that you can buy for money in the whole world, right? So this is the the, the beauty about this very very smart if you think about it, um, that you know they are giving you know the main business to someone who's really experiencing in this experience, and then um, the next generation to not lose time, right? There's time is essential also for Virgin Galactic, um, and therefore you know the guy who built the first product. Um, or lead the first product uh, went on to the next one to building the next one. So I, I believe that that's a fantastic move here by Virgin Galactic. Very, very smart. And more into that when we talk about uh, the conference call. And um, so this was breaking news yesterday. Obviously, the market appreciated that uh, a brand new news, vol very volatile. The funny thing is, though, that we talked about uh, in our Discord channel yesterday, if you should, if you should, um, swing trade um, Virgin Galactic. So buy uh, if it's dipping and uh, or, or selling when it's higher, right? And then buying back when it's uh, dipping. But then, you know, imagine you would uh, sell yesterday and uh, then comes a brand new news like that that absolutely is unexpected and uh, you lose five or more percent. Depending how the market reacts today, I believe that uh, it can stay maybe four, five, three percent up today maybe um, because that's definitely positive news, especially for those who will look a little bit deeper into that will appreciate this move. And um, let me have a look. Uh, this is important guys so the overall market looks a little bit negative as of this morning so this can obviously drag a little bit the or send back the overall um yeah how you call it the overall uh, positive uh, pleasure on virgin galactic stock but let let's see uh, i i don't know about that 
um, uh, it will be quite interesting to see uh, what the stock will do today. So let's have a look into the conference call. So the conference call is quite interesting because on one side it was a funny experience. The first time, you know, we follow the kind of live event. Everyone, you know, from all over the world, you know, there was Ryan, our um, um, our member TC has also joined uh, recently, you know, and we was in, in the uh, Discord, in our Discord channel, just, uh, you know, talking about the, the current uh, conference call that we all were listening to. So it was super fun. And I hope that maybe you want to join as well. Just click the join button below all my videos and live streams, and you will have all the informations there, what you need to do. And uh, when they announced the role, I was very very um, pleasured that actually Shamas was joining also the call and give his two cents. And what he said really sticked to my mind, which is actually that he said when they brought Michael Coglazer into a room and, you know, let him explain what he would do for Virgin Galactic and how he would change the user experience. It was absolutely apparently for them blowing them out of their socks. So he is explaining a whole experience, not only for the astronaut, but also for all the people around this person, right? So people that joining, people that are maybe um, going uh, or staying at home and knowing that they are doing their space galactic flight, maybe in uh, some term of live stream um, or, or whatsoever, you know, it will be absolutely insane, guys. The best experience out there worldwide. And uh, they are having now a very, very, best team to do really really well so i'm i'm super excited and pumped about this move by virgin galactic also you know they're saying that this is uh, they, they highly appreciate what george did uh, so far and he is um, you know, going into the next uh, chapter, building the next products. So this is a fantastic move, guys. Um, and uh, last but not least, uh, because some of you guys are also interested uh, for sure, I read the 8K, which was also released at the same time yesterday after the market closed, uh, which gives us a little bit of detail how much compensation the new uh, person uh, on the role of a CEO gets, uh, which was in this case that um, he will get approximately 500,000 stocks options, which is, you know, as of this current um, uh, current value of the stock about, you know, $9 million as vesting options. Um, then he will receive a base salary of $1 million, uh, which I think it's uh, totally okay. Um, and then he also uh, will be applicable for a 50 or 150% of a bonus uh, on the salary and uh, you know I'm very much excited and I, I, I didn't find it though um, maybe I need to research it a little bit more or maybe you guys in the comments know um, I didn't found the regulations for the bonus so I would love to see when the bonus are getting paid so maybe the bonus is when the first 100 customers are on or maybe the first thousand customers are being catered or some so ever or I don't know five star on Google review uh, or, or something in this in this line so I'm super super excited to understand what the um, measures about the bonuses and the stock options and so on. So I'm, I'm super pumped. I think this is a fantastic opportunity for Virgin Galactic and for people who are, you know, thinking about, is this the right stock to go into? I think, you know, it's a great opportunity now with the CEO move and uh, Shamas confirming 
in the conference call that they are just months away from commercial operations, okay? So this means in the next couple of months, so I believe before the year end, absolutely, they will have Richard Branson in the air, they will have some people in the air already, um, they will have all the necessary licenses and everything uh, sorted out. So I'm super, super excited, guys. This was an affirmation, what we discussed, you know, always here on this channel. Um, and uh, I think that's an absolutely fantastic news. I'm super glad that, uh, uh, you know, you all jumped in on this live stream this morning. Uh Don't forget the thumb up as you have seen <laughs> and uh, I see you in just a couple of hours with my daily vlog I'm now on the road if you want to uh, join me just uh, uh, follow me on Instagram wolf of Dubai Denny just follow me there guys it's um, it's easy uh, it's uh, entertaining it's a little bit behind the scenes I'm taking you with me and uh, I'm super super uh, pumped for Virgin Galactic, uh, it's it makes more and more sense. It shows us that it, they get more and more milestones, and it shows me just you know the main problem, uh, for my personal opinion, in my personal case, is how to move as much as money of my portfolio into the stock. And uh, but you will know here first, and obviously very first in my Discord uh, channel. Uh, in uh, the membership group. So thank you very much for watching and have a fantastic, fantastic galactic day.